Okay, all right, Bible IQ test. All right, true or false, your Bible says that today is the only day of salvation. In other words, unless you get you some religion sometime during your lifespan, if you don't do that, you're destined to go to hell and burn for all eternity. In other words, you have got to get yourself saved before you kick the bucket, is what I'm talking about when I say today is the only day of salvation. That's pretty much what is taught in most mainstream churches, that you've got to, you know, you've got to get yourself saved. And hey, as simple as it is, you would think everybody would get themselves saved. I mean, think about it. All it takes is all oh, heads bowed, all eyes closed. Now, if you accept Jesus into your heart, raise your hand. Oh, I love you, Jesus. Yeah. Oh, oh presto, change oh, Those people are saved. Yeah, you know, you know about the fall away rate of these crusades when they go in there and they get 500 commitments to God or whatever, 500 people get themselves saved. When they go back and do the follow-up, when the follow-up workers go back into those towns, it's a 98% fall away rate. It produces 98% false conversion. That's what it produces. Okay, that's reality, okay? All right. You got to get yourself saved. Today is the only day of salvation. True or false? Well, let's take a look at what Jesus said here in John 6 and verse 44. Jesus said, No man can come to me except the Father which has sent me draw him, and I will raise him up at the last day. Did you get that? Jesus just said, No man can get that. No man can come to me unless the Father draw him. What's my point? My point is this. If God is not calling you, then guess what? Today is not your day of salvation. It's just that simple. Well, why? Well, because Jesus just said, no man can come to me unless the Father draws him. So what happens to all of these people when they die that God is not calling right now? Well, that's a good question. Let's let your Bible answer that question. Revelation 20 and verse 5. But the rest of the dead lived not again until the thousand years were finished. Is that really in the Bible? What you think is in the Bible is not.